Hello and welcome to a special interaction with Bob Brennan. He is the man, CEO of Iron Mountain. Iron Mountain, how do we know it? Well, it's the mystery enigma, sometimes, you know, almost to larger than life proportions. But of course, we have uh, Bob to talk us through Iron Mountain and what it really means. Sometimes you're almost struggling with the kind of image that the place has. At the end of the day, it's a core function. Yeah, so essentially, we do more to protect, store, and drive usefulness out of information as an outsourced service provider than any other company in the world. We're, uh, this past year, we're expected to be about three billion in size. We operate in 38 countries, including, of course, here in India, uh, and have 21,000 employees that are helping 140,000 corporate customers mm -hmm. protect and store their information. Right. Where did it start from? Well, it started as a business where we were looking to help people protect their vital records that were emigrating from Europe. So you needed to prove that you were a doctor or a lawyer or that sort of thing. And that's how the business was started. But it wasn't until the early 80s that the business really took over. Actually, I came on board in 2004, but became CEO in 2008. Okay. But the business really grew up in the 80s and the 90s as we saw the opportunity to essentially partner with companies and then eventually buy their companies so that we could buy these storage companies that essentially kept data that was inactive. A lot of acquisitions, yes. And Yeah, a lot of acquisitions. And then we started to develop services to put on top of that data so that we could help people recover their data, we could help them put retention policy around it, we could help them So understand. what, we are talking about the Fed government, we are talking about Bill Gates, those are the poster boys of your Iron Mountain in some ways, yeah. So for instance, we protect all of the Corbis archives. So Bill Gates bought the Bettman archives at the time, which are now named the Corbis archives, which are all the famous photographs that, that your station uses, that every major newspaper uses to get archive photographs, and we protect those for the Corbis archives as well as for all the major movie studios, as, all, as well as films, uh, vital medical records, financial records. So we do business Investigation with, agencies? Uh, yes. But we do business with the vast majority of the, the large corporations in the world. Mm -hmm. Recession has been an experience for all of us. Um, has it mirrored anywhere in the kind of business or the kind of trends that you read in, or it's just... Uh, standalone. Uh, you know, our business uh, on a relative basis has done very well. Uh, fundamentally, you know, information continues to grow. Information growth doesn't go on recession. But when there's fewer employees uh, and there are discretionary services, there's some cutbacks. So our growth rate has come down a little bit. We're still very much growing as a company and our, our profit uh, performance has been particularly strong during the recession as well. Mm -hmm. Zero failure, is that right? The track record? I'd like to, I'd like to say zero failure. What, what we can say is that we have six nines of reliability, which is much more than that of a, of a regular landline phone call. Uh, so out of uh, literally a million transactions per day, uh, we, we get very, very few wrong. So 99.9999 times, you know, that's our reliability. That's staggering. But okay. it's not zero. I'd um, like it to be zero. We're working on zero, but... Mm. But can that be achieved? Statistically speaking, no. Mm. Uh, but from the standpoint of job number one at Iron Mountain is security. So we would make the argument that we do a much better job than any company doing this for themselves could do it. So as it relates to being able to capture your information, protect it meaningfully, store it for a very long time, period of time, be able to give it back to you when you need it, uh, wherever you need it. Th that's uh, something that we feel we do much better than any other company on the planet. And generally speaking, our competition is companies doing this for themselves. Mm -hmm. uh, and they have nowhere near 99.9999% Certainly, you, you seem like a proud man, and why not? Well, Tuba.com.